In Cloud Service Management, you can add an attachment to a ticket, knowledge article, or configuration item. The simple drag and drop option allows analysts to upload multiple attachments at the same time. This saves numerous clicks and allows them to be more productive, thus reducing mean time to resolution. Let's take a look at how an analyst can quickly attach documents to a ticket. From the ticket center screen, the analyst first opens the ticket to which he needs to add the attachments. Then he goes on to select the actual files he wants to attach. As soon as the analyst drags multiple files over, the focus changes to the attachment section of the ticket and it guides the analyst to drop the files here. Up to a maximum of five attachments can be made at the same time. In case the analyst selects more than five files for attachment, the system prompts to say that this is not allowed. Once attached, the files show up as global attachments that are visible to all users. If the analyst would like to keep a specific attachment private, he can change it individually. In case the analyst wants to add a private attachment only, it requires the browse way of uploading. The drag and drop approach is focused on speed and attaching files that are viewable by all users. The maximum allowable file size of the attachments is determined by a configuration parameter in Cloud Service Management, which is controlled by the administrator. This parameter lets the administrator set the max file size allowed for attachments to any ticket, knowledge article, or configuration item. In this example, the administrator has set the max attachment size to 3 MB. When an analyst tries to attach a file whose size is greater than 3 MB, the system prompts the user that the file size is more than the allowed size.